Hi everyone, welcome to Dental Student Channels. Today I'll talk about something that's really important in our film, which is class 3 preparation and restoration. Also, we will talk about the proper position of the operator. So, let's begin. As we know, before we start any procedure, we have to wear the face shield, the face mask, and the gloves. The back of the operator should be straight. The head is erect and not bent. The forearm and the thigh parallel to the floor and the elbow at the level of the teeth. Of course, class 3 needs indirect vision, 12 position, and the mirror is needs some modification to have clear vision. We start with a drawing symbol class 3 and the measurement is length 3 mm, width 2 mm and the depth is 1.5. The burr used is beer 330. We start drilling following the outline as simple as any preparation. Be careful not damage the adjacent tooth by putting which between the tooth that we work on it and the adjacent. If you want more protection, place a matrix. Try to measure what you have done to be in the safety side and to avoid harm the tooth structure by over drilling. Check if there is any undermine to the structure. The wall is smooth and there is no roughness. Now we move to beveling the margin using the diamond pair. The direction of the pair should be at the 45 degree and be careful because it's really thick from the tooth structure so we don't want to wide beveled margin small is enough and here we didn't turn on the handpiece because we want you to see clearly how the direction be like This is overview of the instruments and material that used in the composite restoration, the acid etching, the adhesive, the composite itself, well for composite material, applicator, widgets, celluloid matrix, finishing and diamond pearl, soft lick disc for finishing, Rubber polishing point, plate number 12, and the composite gold instrument. Now we put the acid etching and try to cover the margin. Be careful to cover the adjacent tooth by putting a matrix. Wash it out and dry it in intermittent way to prevent the collapse of the collagen. Now we put adhesive using applicator. Try to coat every walls and line angles, but not to pulling it. Dry it using the air to have a thin coat, cure it for 20 seconds. Finally, placement of the composite with gold instrument. Try it not to take large increments and remove all the excess try to contour it 
and search for the instrument that is suitable for your situation. To avoid spending time with contouring the proximal area after curing, which is really difficult, try to use a transparent matrix during the cure of the composite. I prefer to start with the plate to remove the gross excess, then move to finishing disc and be careful not to damage the adjacent or the, the same tooth itself. Polishing with the rubber polishing point and polishing paste. Finally, with the Explorer, check any excess in the margin. It should be continuous with the tooth. And finally, this is how it looks like.